Fellow Warriors, how's it going? This is Kess and welcome back to Dynasty Warriors 5 Empires. We are very close to conquer basically all the land. So, Wu is almost subjugated. I can see um, the south of Jing province still needs to submit it. We literally, uh, we, almost, we also conquer, uh, well, almost conquer the northern plains. Only Xi Liang. Uh, remains and I think the the Riverlands as, as well Shu and Nanjong as well also needs to be conquered okay I suppose we need to be ready but this is a new it's a new uh, stratagem so we might as well use it invest in Northern Trade with a hope for receiving golden items yeah that's good that's good stuff then and I also want to increase the troops, my troops, because we do need troops. Let's see. Why there's like there's like an Arabian in uh, in the picture of the northern trade? Am I wrong? Please tell me if I'm wrong. Looks like an Arabian to me. Right, reinforce Jiang Zhao's fleet. Okay, we need uh, to increase troops as much as we can for obvious reasons. Not strain. Don't worry. Nice. Nice. Very, very good. Not sure if we should just stop now. But I say we keep going with increasing our troops. Excellent. And we also got Zwosi. Defense. Right. Can we... Can we really leave this territory? In favor of killing Yuanshu or even Dongju? Mm. Liu Zhang. Where's Liu Zhang anyway? I don't see him anywhere. Oh, he's here. He's invading me, Liu Zhang, basically. He's invading me in person. Okay. Well, instead of defending, I will say let's go attack you. Shoot. We can. We don't need this territory anyway, so. It's a sacrifice. It's a pawn, basically. Sacrificial pawn. Oh, it's Tsai Mao. Let's play, let's play as Tsai Mao. I bet you guys are sick of seeing me play always as the same character. So, <laughs> let's try uh, something different. Because why the hell not? To restore peace to this land, I suppose I had best make my move. Yes, you do, Zwarze. Ooh, it's a big map. What does he have? I thought he had a he had a, a spear. Why does he have a sword? I literally thought time out at sword, but apparently not. He doesn't have a he doesn't have a spear. He has a sword instead. Okay. I always thought Sam had a spear, but in other games, yeah, maybe not in Dynasty Wars 5. Like I said, Dynasty Wars 5 is not exactly my main game. My main Isn't game are mostly is mostly Fight. Dynasty Wars 4. Dynasty Wars 4 is basically my main game, which I I hundred percent many times. Dynasty Wars 3, I only hundred percent it once, only once. So, we can't really say that Steelers 3 it's my main game, but I somehow got a little bit of experience uh, on that Steelers 3. So, oh, he goes, Shall you want moves? Well, I know his moves are mixed, probably. Somehow. His attack is not exactly great, but what can we do? At least he got uh, Shao Yuan as charge 3, which is pretty nice. Yeah, Shao Yuan as charge 3 is good. He also noticed his Musou, um, it's Grand Musou, I noticed. Yeah, see? He doesn't juggle the, the enemy, the Musou, so which is pretty good in my opinion. That's good, that's good. We need to take this on our advantage. His charge 3 and Musou attack are probably his strongest point. I still don't get how the hell I upgrade my, my my weapon, by the way. Thank you for the base. Because I really need to upgrade my weapons. Oh, okay. Let's go. Let's go. 
Let's go with that attack, attack boost, which he, he really needs. Tighten the defenses. Like badly. Badly need an attack boost. You see, I didn't want to bother my main units. So instead I went with the weak ones. But I should be fine. I defeated an officer. However, Ooh, it's slow. Oh, did they use a slow tactic or something? Yeah, it's looking like it. Holy shit, if, you, if we are slow. Oh my god, that's bad. That's really bad indeed. A tactic that, that, that make us very slow. That's no good. Maybe I should use Shuju. Shuju might be... Stronger than Saimao, I suppose. Jesus, when the hell is it gonna have to run out this this tactic? It's very battle, pretty in inconvenient for me. Super inconvenient. Slow as hell. We must not be so careless. It's like uh, we're we're transporting a cargo or something. Jesus Christ. Just as heavy as Bao San Yang's chest. Okay, that, that was bad. <laughs> I apologize. That was really bad. Like, really, really bad. Jesus. Can see, I can put it now the unsubscription. Or, oh no, Kesson, that was so lame. Yes, I know, I know. I know it was lame. Oh, Andal, purple does not suit you at all. It doesn't suit you at all. Um, you know what I always found hard about Empire's games? The fact that uh, to upgrade your carters, uh, it was not exactly easy. Like, you always have to focus on a certain carter to... Um, when you play. That's what I always thought, at least. It's no easy, really, upgrading uh, every single carters. At least in the old Empire's games. Maybe in the new Empire's games it, it's, it can be easier, but obviously it's no easy in, in five Empires, that's for sure. Even in other, even in, in old Empire's games, like Samurai Wars 2 Empires, it's not really easy to upgrade officers. You always have to go uh, with, a, with a specific officer each battle, really. Uh, so... You could literally finish the game uh, ASAP, so. However, in Dance Stewards for Empires, uh, many characters that I've recruited were actually pretty strong, like Yanbayu. Yanbayu, for some reason, was always my strongest NPC. I don't know why. I don't know, I always found Yanbayu as a really, really strong NPC. I I don't know. Maybe I maybe I always go Yambayu in a phase of, a, of the game where um, where it was a really good le level up for good. But uh, I do really need stronger cards, it seems, because now I arrive on a point with a game where everybody has leveled up. Every 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 enemy officers got got good levels. As you can see, they really start to get extremely aggressive. Really, really aggressive. What is that room so? Jesus. He got such a bad room so attack. He doesn't like send the enemy flying at all. The NPC sword. <laughs> what? It's so lame. It's probably just as lame uh, just as the NPCs from from Samurai Warriors 5. You know the the unique uh, playable characters that are supposed to be NPCs, but they got unique skins. Yeah, but it pretty, pretty much it feels like I am I'm playing like that really with the unique officers. However, Samurai is not a unique officer. Even to he should be a unique officer in my opinion. Samurai. Well, think about it. Samurai plotted with Cao Cao to to steal Jing Province. He literally was the, the reason that Jing Province fell into the hand of Cao Cao. So why not making him at least a, a unique uh, officer or something? 
by using that to be playable, just make him give him a unique appearance and that's it. I do think that Cartus uh, needs to be at least to have a unique ap appearance, but no, don't make them playable. You know what I mean? At least you can focus on, on better cartas in the game, but some useless cartas were useless. Some cartas that they are important, but not so important to be playable, should at least have a unique appearance. I don't know if you know what I mean. Because somehow, even if he wasn't exactly, you know, this big shot, uh, he didn't last a very long somehow in the end. However, he actually committed some deeds that might as well uh, be recognized as a you know, as, an, as having a unique appearance, not as a playable, as a playable character, but at least a unique appearance should should do, really, in my opinion, to give him some justice. Yeah, Samo was a traitor, backstabber. However, what he did was actually smart. Samo wasn't a stupid man. Samo managed to steal Jing Province from uh, from Liu Biao when he died and give it to Cao Cao, so Tsai Mao could, uh, could become rich and be filled with ranks from Cao Cao. Yeah, okay, it is still Jing Province out of greed, but still in Jing Province wasn't exactly easy. Yeah, Tsai Mao's family was quite powerful. He he was a, he had a very powerful uh, family, Tsai Mao, because his sister, his uh, older sister, was married to, to Liu Biao. So yeah, the Tsai family was, in fact, Quite, uh, quite popular in, in, in Jing province, and somehow abused uh, the popularity of the of the Tsai, of the Tsai family to no to steal Jing province and install his nephew Liu Song, the the younger brother the younger brother of Liu Qi, half brother actually, but whatever. Yeah, installing as uh, as the heir. In order to so he, he could control Liu Song and still Jing Province. So yeah, but then somehow fell for a plot of Zhou Yu, <laughs> which costed him costed him his life, and Cao Cao killed him, and then he realized later his mistake. So yeah, it was quite uh, impressive, really how. Sai Mao died. He was basically, honestly, I must say, Sai Mao's death was very unlucky. He was very, very unlucky, in my opinion, his death. Like, really, he probably had a chance to save himself, Sai Mao. But to be honest, his life and death it, it completely uh, fell on Cao Cao's hands. And judgment skill. Cao Cao uh, had a very poor judgmental skill at that moment, and so Sai Mao's dead. Uh, Sai Mao, uh, Sai Mao, you know, Sai Mao died because because uh, Cao Cao was being a very poor of judgment all of a sudden, which is very weird because usually Cao Cao he, he, he is sharp. He doesn't get fooled by those by those stupid plots. Let's be honest, though, uh, the plot of um, of Zhou Yu wasn't that great. It was just Cao Cao being poor of judgment all of a sudden. I mean, really. Jiang Gan, the one who was sent uh, into Wu territory to spy on Zhou Yu, because Jiang Gan, it, it was, in Jiang Gan and Zhou Yu were childhood friends, so that uh, Jiang, Jiang Gan abused the, the opportunity to get close to Zhou Yu and convince him to, to join Cao Cao but failed miserably. But instead, uh, but Zhou Yu knew that he was Cao Cao's spy, so what he did was plotting to kill Tsai Mao by, make, by forging a fake letter uh, Making it look like Tsai Mao sent a letter to uh, to Zhou Yu, so they could still Jing, uh, so he could uh, kill Cao Cao. But Cao Cao uh, got hold of the letter through Jiang Gan, and uh, I'm about to die here. And yeah, he killed uh, Tsai Mao and Zhang Yun. Since Zhang Yun was also a naval commander of Cao Cao. Cao, Cao. And yeah, with Sa uh, with uh, Tsai Mao and, and Zhang Yun's dead, In battle, one's head is not for uh, the battle should be literally uh, got a new direction because Tsai Mao, even to is very incompetent on land. He's not exactly the you know the smartest general when it comes on land. However, he's one of the top na naval commanders, Tsai Mao, and facing Tsai Mao. 
in a naval battle, it, it means certain defeat or deep struggling, even even for Vu. Even if, if Wu is is facing Tsai Mao, they will have a very hard time. And obviously, Tsai Mao was literally leading Cao Cao's army, which was huge uh, during Shu Vi. Tsai Mao had the advantage as well, so he could have used Cao Cao's large army to win at Shu Vi. But, uh, but, that, but obviously, uh, Zhou Yu knew that, and so he tried everything to kill Tsai Mao. And so he did. So think about it. But what if, what if uh, Cao Cao reconsidered about killing Tsai Mao? Then what? Uh, think about it. Oh, I need to run away. If Cao Cao uh, reconsidered of killing uh, Tsai Mao, maybe uh, Wu will have lost the Chubi. Think about it. They should probably make a what if. A what if. Um, I can't really face them two together. Too strong. Need to take a new base. So yeah, if they um, if they survive, Simon and Zhang Yun, they do, probably they will want to battle Chubi because they are they are expert naval commanders. Them too. Here they come again. Prepare for uh, let me take this base instead. Even to my HP is still very bad. I really should be careful. I'm honestly, I, I'm always reckless. I'm always reckless, but whatever. It's fine even if I lose, to be honest. I mean, Empire's game are also about that, about losing. Can't always win. Can't always win. Yeah, thank you for the base, but can I get some health now? No, you cannot have any health, Saimao. Fuck you. <laughs> Literally, fuck you. Alright. And we guess we got all we have to do is now kill an officer. You know what? Let's charge now. I think it's now it's the time to charge. Yeah, it's now time to charge, I think. I, I would like to see, to be honest, to be honest I would do like to see a what if. Um, I will attack that if Cao Cao all of a sudden have a change of heart and change his mind about killing Sam Ao. I would love to see that. That would be awesome. What do you guys think? I really think they should probably do something like that. It will be so cool. It will be so damn cool if they can make a, 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 that what if, that kind of what if. Oh shit, I even lost an item. Come on. Ah. Well, it was pretty obvious that I would have died. Like I said, it's about even losing sometimes. I'm not gonna lie, but I kind of forgot about uh, somehow being being weak. This is what happens every time I use a different carter than my main carter. I always lose. <laughs> really. Every time I use a different carter, I always lose. It's no easy training training carters sometimes, really. It's no easy. Well, at least we have not lost our, uh, our territory. His has I am so happy. We just failed. We not lost anything. Okay, that's good. Right. I think maybe we should declare alliance with Donjo so we, we don't have to worry about him. Why not? Right. right. Yeah, right indeed. Okay, increase defense of all heroes under our control. And also, set a win Mongo. Let's see. Strongly encourage the element within the heroes under your guard. Yeah, yeah. As you we got Eugene. Oh no, Champagne. We got Champagne. Okay. Nice. Train Shuju. Let's save. There's glory even in defeat. See, nobody invaded us, as you can see. Um, 
We should probably, maybe we should, I, I don't want to take my revenge against Yuan Shu, okay? So instead, uh, we could probably uh, open a path for for Namman, which means killing Liu Jiang, but that's obvious, but I need to station, oh shit, I forgot to station. I'm so smart, I forgot to station. Chris attack level of all smashes by 20. That's yes. Nice, nice. Yeah, we also need to level up our weapons. But I just got this smart this smarting just now, as you guys will see. 8. It took me ages to get this smarting, really. Way too long, so. So yeah, I'm gonna get some gold now. Okay, time to station troops now. Let's see, where's Saki? Hmm, where is she? Who is that sender? Oh my god, in Puyang. She's in Puyang. What are you doing in Puyang, Saki? Yeah, get, get out, get off from there. Right. Okay. But I'm not done yet to station troops. So Saki go here. We also yeah, we probably need um Luo Yang to to be filled with a with a few troops, to a few officers, because uh, we are close to Donjo and Yuan Shu. So that will that would be great, maybe. Uh let's see, what can we get? Obviously, cartes with troops. Uh John Liao. Okay, uh, okay, perfect. Uh, look in here. Oh, zero troops gosh, No, no, no. Okay. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, now we can definitely go destroy Liu Jiang. Perfect. We can definitely... Let me see if... I wanna see something. No. Oh, actually, gunning is actually quite good. Yeah. But I'm gonna be safe and you suck. I'm sorry. But we have to. We need to be safe. No need uh, to be to showing off and being reckless. We need to be smart. I know I will probably have the chance to level up gunning, but like I said, it's best to focus on only a certain officers in in this kind of Empire's games. We really can't afford to, you know, to to be reckless. We really can't, honestly. Can we really win here? As you can see, we're also on Chengdu. You know what? I'm gonna. But I'm gonna be reckless on this. I will try uh, to do an order attack. Let's do this at least. Let's try to yeah, make an order attack. Base. Make everybody attack, okay? Uh, that's all. That's probably the best I can do with being reckless, okay? Do you think you can stop me? Yeah, see, look. Look at her. Look, look how strong she is. I can win the game easily. Plus, no, look, look, they start to get, they, they got so aggressive now. They are so damn aggressive, the enemies. We really can't, um, can't afford to do any mistakes at all. Like, really. Jesus, if it lags Chengdu, my god. Cheng lag. In this damn fog. My god. We need to be careful about shooting Yu Chong, because if they if they kill him, he'll be captured. Even to really don't care. <laughs> they can get they can have it for what I care. Let us make an example of it's kinda making me confuse this this fog, I'm not gonna lie. Well that was supposed to do, I, su no I think. No, honestly, we need to get away from this fog. It's really bad though. It's really bad. 
Maybe because it's an empowers game, so they they make it a fear. They make they give you the feel of being of the fog being more annoying. I don't know. See now the main camp is in danger. It bothers me because I cannot give order to certain officers. If you give order, you give order to all the officers. This is what bothers me really. Thank God they changed that. They changed that. I don't remember which Empire's game they changed that. See, look, I have to go rush to to my main camp to stop that. I cannot. I cannot order. I cannot give the order to one of my allies to do that. No, I have to go myself. See, look. Uh, I don't think I can. Let's try, but. See, no, you cannot give. Oh no, actually, I'm so stupid. I I'm dumb. Sorry, I'm dumb. Right, you can. You can. You actually can. Sorry, but I don't know. I don't. I didn't remember really in which game. Uh, you could do that. You could start giving orders to certain yeah. units. It's because in four empires they won't let me do it. But in this game, apparently they let you do it. Okay, I'm sorry, but that was my bad. That was totally my bad. Really, I totally. <laughs> Done a big mistake, but whatever. Hopelessness is not Where's Ganin going? I literally ordered him to. It's not working very well. Why is he going there? Go attack. Uh... There. I ordered Ganin to attack uh, Mr. Wang Shao. Is he even going? Can't really tell. What? It's not going. He's not going. I don't I don't understand what I'm doing wrong. Why why isn't my orders are not working? What am I doing wrong? What the fuck, man? I honestly have no idea what the fuck is going on. Oh. Let us make an example Whatever, of but it's not exactly the best AI uh, when it comes to giving orders. Yeah. Cut through the enemy I'll ranks. be honest. Because I, I can't tell what they're doing, you know. Cut through the enemy ranks. No quarter. I gave Ganyi an order, but Yeez was going on a different direction for no fucking purpose. So I'm wondering, was the order working or not? That's what, that's what bothers me. But yeah, I suppose now the problem for those Empire's like games uh, literally um, doesn't exactly exist anymore. Because now they, they can improve the AI and the mechanism of the game. Well, they improve more the mechanics of the game than the AI, definitely. Hey, now you're getting the hang of it. I've taken over the space. See, she's so aggressive. I could literally finish the game in two seconds if I keep using Saki all the time. It's about time I face a worthy opponent. Enemy officer defeated. What's the main camp? Right, but I don't think I can already I can get it already, so we first gotta get more bases. Where are you going? It's about time I faced a worthy opponent. Enemy officer defeated. We almost got Chengdu. For now. Enemy officer defeated. However, uh, Donjo got Shiliang, so we are not exactly updating uh, the wool uh, the wool plains, the wool northern plains. I think we got the center plains already. I've taken over the space. Very nice. Maybe after this base, after I got this base, I can get the main camp. Maybe. Did you think you could overcome this base? I lost the battle, but as you can see, we uh, I've taken over the space. we literally got more than that. You want to only go like one small tiny character, which which we can subjugate any time. However. Liu Jian gone more than that. Okay. Now 
we might be able to get the main camp now. Even through all the area, it's it's all red. I don't I don't understand why. Because we all got the base in the area, so that's kind of weird. Well, we'll try to get the main camp then. We'll try. We'll try now. Let's see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch. Knock knock, Mr. Liu Zhang. No. Oh, now all of a sudden the. Ah, uh, thank you, Jeanne. Okay, come on me, bro. Come on, be. Come on, be. What beauty? My, my ranks will always been beautiful. I don't know. Oh! Whoa! Aggressiveness overloaded! Jesus! Jesus Christ! Not even that Steel Street got this fucking uh, broken AI! Stop! Oh my god! No, this is. Oh, I, I, I can't do shit! What the fuck? Hit me with everything Not you even Dusty with a streak goes crazy AI like this. What the fuck, man? Honestly, AI's in Pirates games are absolutely aggressive. Oh my god. Shall we dance through the enemy camp? Oh my fucking god! The aggressiveness! It's about time I faced a worthy opponent. The aggressiveness of Dynasty Warriors! In by fucking Iris! No. No, 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 no. This is, this is, this is, this is nuts. This is nuts. This is nuts. They are literally on crack. They are. Sm what did they smoke? I, I don't know what did they smoke. These people. What? Is it really musawing? Look, that troop was just musaw. What the fuck? I. I think this is the first time I see troops musawing in, in Dynasty Wars Five. Oh my god! I didn't even know troops called musaw in in, in 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 Five. Must be an empire thing. Holy shit. Okay, that. That was insane. No, that was insane. Sorry. Some battles you win, and some battles you lose. Okay, th that, that was just insane. Sorry. Oh my god. And this game also got chaos difficulty. I don't even want to imagine what's gonna be like. I, I don't wanna know. Like, I don't wanna know. Musa plus 20. Oof. Nice. Uh, yeah, we might as well have defense in instead of luck. Holy shit. Right. Nice. To be honest, we don't need these people. We really don't. I really, we really don't need them. Let's be honest. I'll take Liu Zhang. Hmm. Wow, that was a battle. That was such a battle. Alright, uh, fellow words, then I guess this is everything for now, and I'll catch you guys soon to the next episode. As always, like, subscribe, comment, maybe consider becoming a member of my channel. Uh, yeah, so you can get access to exclusive perks and even support me uh, with more uh, with more contents to come. Coffee time if you want to get access to video previews. Muslim member and ultimate member if you want to get access to exclusive let's play. The ultimate member is for people who wants to support this channel really bad. I still got the same perks of Muso. Thanks again and I'll catch you guys soon. Take care.